Hi. Here in this question, we have in a race of three horses, the first beat the second by 11 meters and the third by 90 meters. If the second beat the third by 80 meters, what was the length of the track here? Okay. So, let's say this is the starting point. The race is from this point till this point. Let's say the three horses are A, B and C. So, the A beats B by 11 meters and A beats C by 90 meters. So, this total distance is 90. So, 90 minus 11 is 79 meters. So, distance between B and C is 79 and distance between A and B is 11 meters. Okay. Now, what happens is, by the time B finishes the race, B beats the third by 80 meters. So, by the time B finishes the race, C is 80 meters behind. C is at, let's say, at this point and this distance is 80 meters. So, when B was at this point, C was 79 meters behind, but by the time B travels another 11 meters, C becomes even 1 meter further behind, falls 1 meter further behind. So, what happens is, by the time B travels 1 meter, the distance or 11 meters, sorry, by the time B travels 11 meters, the distance between B and C increases by 1 meter. So, for every 11 meters that B travels, distance between B and C increases by 1 meter. So, for the distance for B and C to increase by 79 meters, see initially they were at the same point. Now, when the distance between them is 79 meters, we can calculate the distance traveled by B, right? So, if the distance between them has to become 79 meters, the distance B would have traveled is 79 into 11 meters, which is 9, 6, uh, 8, 869 meters. So, B has traveled a total distance of 869. So, this total distance is 869 meters plus the length, uh, the distance between A and B 11. So, the total length of the track is 869 plus 11, which is 880 meters. So, the answer to this question is 880 over here. Okay. So, that's it for this question. Thank you.